Hi, this is Dasbox Mom, and welcome back to Let's Play Heroes Chronicles. At the end of the previous episode, Tarnum had just uncovered this Green Key Master's tent at about the same time that Mensor found a green border guard. Yeah, about around in here. So now. Mensor went through the border guard, found a hill fort, got his troops upgraded. Now we're ready to go through this two-way monolith and see what potential goodies might be on the other side. We've also eliminated two of the four enemy AI factions, the blues and the greens. We've spotted the pink faction, don't really have direct access to them yet, and there should be one more faction. We've also spotted a couple of neutral castles, there's one here, and another one here. They're both behind quest guards. So, let's... Keep going. Ooh, lots of goodies here. Looks like this is a isolated little cavern near that lost cavern where Trin and Norwin were. The Red Tent! I've been looking for that! So I know that red tent would let us get to that neutral castle. Of course, there's also a way that you can, that you might be able to get to it past those Medusas, but it doesn't look like the purple guys have tried it. But as long as Mensor's here, go ahead and pick up all these resources. And then we'll have Tarnum continue exploring there. Yeah. As usual, there wasn't anything on the skeleton. Once in a while there is, but... Okay, and it looks like Tarnum's pretty much caught up to about where Mensor had gotten on this corridor, because I remember this Forsaken Palace from before. And basically, Trin is just waiting for it. we can get the next week to pick up more halflings. And meanwhile... Excuse me. We'll go hire some more troops for our various castles. Okay, looks like maybe try building an upgrade structure here. Because you never know when one of those remaining AI factions is going to break through. <coughs> Excuse me. Purple guys are on my side. I have to keep reminding myself of that. Okay. Novan's brought another week's worth of troops up from the underground. And 
think he's getting a lot upgraded now. <laughs> and truthfully, with all those halflings, we don't absolutely need to build the portal of glory. I mean, angels are nice, but we get plenty of troops this way anyway. Alright, well... Maybe we can have Norvan go exploring down this way. That might give us an early warning of anything the pink guys might be up to. And meanwhile, Tarnum can flag that Forsaken Palace. Yes, it's devils, but there's only three of them. And this is Tarnum we're talking about. Who has the Angelic Alliance, and... Tons and tons of spell points. It's like even a magic arrow can take out the entire stack. And no. Doesn't have room for them. Can't afford them. Could try him sending him down that way, or maybe over here to the red border gate. Let's see if we can start developing that neutral castle. At least I'm trusting that Mensor will reach the red keymaster's tent by the time. Tarnum gets to that red border gate. Okay, we'll save before we tackle the vampire lords. And they run. So it doesn't really matter. Okay. So that wasn't a problem. And then we'll build some more things. Maybe a level 2 mage guild. Just in case we get a garrison hero in here. Alright, then maybe upgraded Hall of Sins. Okay. Alright, last day of the first month. or heading towards that red border guard. Although it looks like there's something blocking his path. Probably that purple hero, Charna. Skeleton Transformer, that's pretty useful of you. Get a garrison hero in who has non necropolis type two troops. And the 
upgraded kennels here. And we can turn our heck hounds into Cerberi. And then let's just recruit some more troops here. Okay, that'll help. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Mensor's interrogation of the captured demons has turned up very little information about Thesilus' whereabouts. Our prisoners are more afraid of the demon Duke than my captain of information. If I still had the taste for torture, I'd interrogate them myself, and show them who they really should fear. But those days are gone, thankfully. All we've been able to determine is that Diesel's secret manor lies somewhere behind a subterranean gate. Okay, so that might explain why we haven't spotted that last enemy AI faction on the main level of the map. And we keep having imp week everywhere. Probably have me at least pick up a few reinforcements from our starting castle. Okay, looks like we can go through there. No idea what that quest guard is going to want. Okay. Charn is blocking the way again. Oh. All right. Hmm. I think resource silos that provide wooden ore are pretty useful. Usually. I guess this time Trin's going to be picking up all the troops herself. build here until I do get the Portal of Glory build, which, as I said before, I suspect there's not going to be really any need for in this scenario. Okay, that should stiffen Norvan's army. Until you reach level 30, you may not join. So actually, we need to send Norvan up here. <coughs> the 
another way to get out. I'm a little surprised the purple guys haven't tried this. imps that we could take out, but I think probably it would be more practical to link up with Norvan and swap troops with him. Oh, look at that. That would take me straight into the pink territory. Now there is this area here. So perhaps I should clear this bit first. Certainly en enough resources here. Maybe we should have Norman stop at the castle first. And hire more troops. At least we got a lot of zealots out of it. everything here. Oh, do you see that? Looks like a neutral necromancer castle.
Okay. Yeah. We might be able to have Norman pick up some more champions. I don't think we can afford to hire any more troops there. right there no. Van go get these units upgraded. some more troops. Okay, there is a bit of a garrison, but I suspect Norvan probably can handle it even with his tiny army. Okay, now we'll send Tarnup down this way to scope out the pink faction. Well, we'll finish clearing this little bit of the surface map and have Norvan take that neutral Arathian castle in the next episode, so we will see you then.